Hey everybody, Sam Taylor here, Cancer Cure Bus, episode 10, My Language Center, Another Miracle. So as I was going through the initial tests at University of Nebraska Medical Center, Dr. Eisenberg wanted me to run some kind of basic uh, baselining tests. When they did my visual test, visual field, I've talked about my, my issues with my vision. So you see the big blind spot up in the upper left quadrant, and then everything's kind of blurry. So uh, that's my life right now no longer driving um, and I'll talk about in an up upcoming episode why it's actually a, a been a real blessing having my vision impaired like this. So that's, they ran those tests but the other thing they wanted to do was some baseline neuropsych tests. You know, Sam, our big question is we're trying to figure out where is your language center in your brain? Is it on the left side? Is it on the right side? For everybody it's different, depends. I'm left-handed. So we run these tests um, and boy talk about interesting. And so the tests whole series of tests, and it's a lot of you know, memory. And as we're going through the test, what I found is, you know, they're looking at a long list of words, and you have to re repeat back these words, and then 10 minutes later, they ask the same words. And those kind of things, I was actually pretty good at. I could do okay on that. But then there's visual memory tests. And oh my goodness, I was horrible. They have these, this one, there's a page of all these circles, and they give you, uh, they show a page of all these circles, and then there's a page with like, some of them are filled in with red dots. And then they give you a piece of paper with all the circles and they give you these checkers and you're supposed to put the checkers where you saw on the page. And oh my goodness, I had such a hard time. They kept showing me the page again and again and again and I just couldn't get it. That's horrible. So any kind of you know, visual memory was really, I could tell it was bad. All day long and then at the end of the day they come back and the two doctors are smiling. And because at the beginning they said, we, we want to find out where your language center is. We hope it's on the left side. That's what they said. Like, okay. And at the end of the day, they come back with the results and they say, hey, Sam, we're so pleased to announce that your language center is on the left side of your brain. I go, oh, okay, great. Why is that good news? <laughs> and um, so they figured out through all these tests that that's where my language center is. Some people it's on the right, some people it's on the left. And they said, well, it's, it's good news because your tumor is located on the right side of your brain. And the, the tumor that I have, it's in that thalamus area. It's kind of on the right side um, of the thalamus. They said the tumor is on the right side of your brain. And that's why your visual field, that's why your left side, you have this blind spot up here on the left side because it, you know, optic nerve crosses. So the tumor's on the right side, it's impacting the left side vision. They said, um, we're happy that your language center is actually on the left side of your brain because if we're on the right side of the brain where the tumor is, imagine all those problems you're having with your vision, you'd be having those same problems with your speech. And I went, Wow. They said, you would not be able to form words. You would not be able to speak. If the language center were on your right side of your brain, the tumor would be impacting that based on the parts of the brain and all, how that works. So they were, that's why they were hoping it was on the left side. And I'm so grateful it's on the left side because I wouldn't be able to be speaking to you today. I wouldn't be able to do what I'm doing and what I feel like my, my purpose in life now is if I couldn't articulate my thoughts. They said, you wouldn't be able to speak, and sometimes you wouldn't even be able to, you know, form sentences. You'd be so frustrated because you know what you want to say, but you wouldn't be able to say it. So for me, again, those miracles in unexpected places, because it could have been on my right side, and then I would be in real trouble. So again, for me, that was another sign, one of those little miracles in unexpected places, one of those tender mercies. Miracles exist. I'm seeing them every day just like that blessing promised me, miracles in unexpected places. Um, and that's what we need to look for. And that's where uh, faith comes in. Faith comes first, and then the miracles come. And then your faith grows. And then more miracles. And it just keeps growing and growing. And that's what I've been going through for the last several weeks, month and a half. Um, and that's where I'm at. So that's my message for the cancer warriors. Faith. Keep your faith. Stay strong. You will find peace. God bless you. God bless your families. Thanks again.